Check this clip out. You sound in thanks that one. How are you? Huh? I didn't hear anything to say. All right, top back and forth of the month, November. Belmont and Providence. I know nothing about college basketball. Don't follow it. Don't care. However, this got my attention. I'm going to tell you what actually made me start looking at this play. It wasn't the uh, the initial what winds up being the play in question. It was the reaction of the winning team that got my attention. Here it goes. 22nd, Belmont Providence, Austin Luke, Dylan Wingler, Dylan ripping and rhyming, but then this. Here comes Cartwright between two defenders at the buzzer. Okay, great buzzer beater, dribbles down, nobody's playing defense. Their excuse for that would be they didn't want to foul him and send him to the line. Okay, whatever. But here's what got my attention to make me start studying this play. Look at these guys. Watch the, the guy who made the winning shot. Look at him. See, that right there got my attention. I mean, why is he acting like, like he is so bad? Why isn't it just being happy and jubilant? But he's got this real cockiness going on. And that right there is typically a telltale sign that some shenanigans took place and they're trying to cover it. They're diverting. This is a diversion right here. Right. That right there just doesn't, it just rubs me wrong. So then I started looking at this place. So right here is where it gets real weird. Watch this guy's Basically, he did an alley-oop pass to this guy here. A very unusual alley-oop, but he pulls it off. But watch, see if you don't see something wrong with the ball. Okay, regular speed. Just do regular, regular speed at first. Do you see it? You may not be able to pick it up on, the, on this screen here. It didn't happen. Because Do you see it? The I'm going to slow mo it now. It's going to be very strange. I'm not trying to influence. Just watch this and I'm going to point it out. Okay. The score is 66. There's some six sixes involved with this. This guy's got six. Providence has 66 points right here. I think that was the winning, that was the winning shot, right? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Belmont. Was a lot for Casey's mid-major It didn't happen. Yeah, they won 66 to 65. Okay, here he goes. Try to slow mo this properly. Here he goes. Watch this. Do you see it? Again, I'm gonna mute him. Okay, it's muted. Slow mo. Slow mo. Did you see it right there? The ball does a jerk. It jerks. It moves. It, it moves position on its track. It changes its track as it's in the air. And that is not putting English on the ball by any means. That's not what that is. And at the point where it, just as it does, it's shifting of position in midair. That's what the number on the clock says. Here we go. It did its shift in a 6.6 .6 seconds left on the clock. Again, watch the shift. This might be slightly lengthy, but I want you to see it. I'm going to do it several times. This slow mo. Come on, get past that. It's a, it's a shifting. Just as he releases, the ball does a, like it does a, it does this. With my, with my finger motion, the ball does a, a slight, and then does that. Okay, again. Here we go. And you see it right there. Again. Watch the shift. There was a shift right there. Again. Slow mo it. 
There it was. Again. That's really good. There it was again. One more time. I don't want to sound like I'm crazy. There's the ship. One more time. There it was. And when it does its shift, 6.66 seconds left. Now, something else weird.